Yo, what's going on YouTube? It's your boy Lex Thomas 21. I'm back for another quick video for you guys. This is my part three of my 2K17 wish list slash fix list. If you want to say, because I haven't been talking about stuff I want them to fix in the last video, and also putting in things I want in in the next game as well. Um, so let's so go ahead and talk about it. The first thing I want to talk about is the face scanning and the customization. I, I don't know if I talked about enough customization in the last video, but I want to talk about it more in this game. Um, the face scanning. Um, can you guys find an easier way? I know I saw the last 2K TV where Ronnie2K was trolling us with the phone, going back and forth on his phone. So I guess that is confirmed saying that there will be an app you can do, finally do it off your phone like NBA Live. So hopefully the face scan will be more accurate to what we look like. Uh, I think my character does look like me, but it doesn't really look like me in my opinion. Uh, Live 17, uh, Live 16, my character really did look like me as more as I did in this, in this game. So um, that, let's, that, that's why I don't think I want them to change. The next thing I want to change is uh, hairstyle. The hairstyle, just add more hairstyle or give us an option to customize hairstyles. Um, a lot of people wear certain different hairstyles. They don't just have an afro. They have an afro with a fade. They have an afro with you know, a cut or something. It's always certain different ways they change the hairstyles. Um, I always try to change my hairstyle within like how my character goes within the years. So um, I, I would just say just give us more customization to do with that. Uh, body types. Give us um, different body types or have us customize our own body types. Uh, there's no way my my for my for my my do iPhone he's like two two hundred some pounds and I'm like hundred some pounds we look the exact back the same uh, weight there's no way that should that should be look like like that um, live, uh, live sixteen kind of had it right a little bit where they gave you different body types how you want to look uh, you could look slim muscular you know lean you could look all different type of ways because not every player looks alike um, next thing I want to talk to is skin tones uh, can you guys try to get a little bit more skin tones. Um, if you guys not going to do the face, do at least add some more faces into the game. I like that you was able to customize the way the faces look, but um, just just a little bit more of that. Um, the the hairstyles and uh, the face scanning, and um, let's get into tattoos. Tattoos. We just need more variety of tattoos. Um, or how about we would be able to import our own tattoos into the game? Like I have tattoos on my forearms that I would love to see on my character, um, as well as get tattoos from other sources like well we can go to google search from 2k and import that tattoo onto the game how amazing that would be that would be freaking amazing i would love that that idea um now getting from tattoos let's get on to the clothes i think i talked about the clothes in a couple videos but let's get back into it i love that they add the marvel stuff in here since since we already seen marvel let's go to dc let's bring in star wars let's bring our different brands back let's bring back the the derrick rose joggers let's bring back the derrick rose clothing i understand jordan was a big factor in the clothing in this game that's probably why we didn't see a lot of derrick rose clothing but let's bring that back. I love the Derrick Rose clothes as well. And as well, I love that they imported some of the Jordan clothes. Keep that in there. We love that. We love seeing that type of stuff. Um, speaking of clothes, let's go ahead and talk about the way the 2K store is set up. Um, I, I watched uh, iPod King Carter and Shakedown. They both had interesting points about this. Give us our own closet to store our clothes. Is that hard to do 2K? There's no way we sh I should have to go into the My Player Store, go to the sneakers, go to Jordan, and select what shoes that I bought. There's no way that should happen. I should be able to go to my own closet and pick the shoe that I made or that I bought. And another thing, please fix the glitch where we have to rebuy the shoe that we created that I already bought. There's no way I should have to do that. That's really upsetting. I'm, I'm really pissed at that. Because um, that, that kind of stuff pissed me off. Because I had to rebuy some LeBron that I created. And I had to rebuy them again because the store glitched on me. That's why they, we, it, it would make sense to give us a closet to put our own clothes in there. Um, and that's all I got to say about the clothing. I would love to see more variety of clothes as well. Um, different styles and um, just different things like that. Um, more of the customization. I had no idea. Oh, facial hair. Facial hair was cool. I had no problem with the facial hair this year. Um, but that's all I have to say. Um, let's go into some of the, uh, the animations and some of the dribble moves and stuff like that. Uh, just give us more uh, variety of dribble moves. Like, um, if I want to get Kyrie's moves, just put it all in one specific area. 
don't have me go to certain styles and click each one at certain at each player. Put it all in one package. If I want to have all Steph Curry or if I want to have all Kyrie's moves, just give me all of his moves. Don't have me select a certain thing where I got to find it and all this dumb stuff, man. Just put it all in one thing. It'll be easier. Same with dunk packages. If I want to have all LeBron's dunkers, dunks packages, just let me get all of his dunks. If I want to get Jordan's dunks, Get me get all his all his dunks. I don't want to have to select tomahawks and all these different things. Um, Cause sometimes they don't even let me do those dunks. Sometimes I get stuck doing a stupid uh, two hand dunk or some dumb dunk that's not really equipped. Um, another thing I want to talk about is the jump shots. Like I said, go back to the way it was on 2K14 where they had the release and they had the base. That would be so much easier because not everyone have the same freaking jump shot. It's so irritating seeing that everyone has the same jump shot. Everyone has LaMarcus Aldridge, everybody has Steph Curry, everybody have every everybody's jump shot. It's so everybody, not everyone shoots the same. So let's go ahead and change that as well. Let's go ahead and uh, change that up as well. I would love that in 2K17. Um, what else? Um, I think that's about it. All I want to talk about. Um, I think this is gonna be the last video of my 2K17 wish list series. I, don't, I think, I, I, like I said, I talked about some of the modes. I talked about my career. I talked about um, park. I just talked about customization animations. Um, but uh, I heard that there, uh, and t there's some other news saying that we're gonna be able to control our animations with, let's say, if we want to interact with the crowd and stuff with the right stick. I heard that's a possibility. So let's hope that is true. I um, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please slap the like button. Please subscribe for more. I'm going to let the video ride out. hope you guys enjoyed it. Like I said, go ahead and leave a comment in the comment section what you guys want in 2K17. Um, and please share the video. And I'm out on this one, you guys. Peace.